from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga. Now, first of all, I'm going to put it flat, but I wouldn't display it flat. I'll show you in a minute why. Uh, little uh, mountains and valleys, almost geodes, of uh, sitting on a matrix, pretty red. So I, I think a lot of heterogeneity in this matrix, in this dolomite, and of course malachite as well. And dusting this would be a layer of tiny quartz crystals, which are absolutely see-through. This guy is not all that photogenic. A very, very showy piece, though. Very, very aesthetically appealing. Now, you have two points of display. You could have it standing on a stand like this. Get a nice angle, and we're focusing on the top view. So, from that particular angle, looking at the top, from the top down, we'd have this effect. So, lovely cavity. Now, when you look under magnification, you can actually see through the little clear quartz crystals. And on some sections of this particular material, I've also found a yellow material. I'm not sure if there's any on here. So, there may be some little nasties here as well. Um, the, the, the hot materials from the Katanga, of course, not going to be harmful in any way. The, it'll be so minor, like your microwave or maybe some uh, uh, vehicle appliances. All the way from the Tenke Fungurumu mine in the Katanga, there we have it. A little bit overexposed as we're seeing it. Um, I think the still picture is pretty good on this one. You can actually zoom in and have a look at those little formations.